Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be cleaning my car because it is an absolute disaster. Um, I guess not a disaster, it's just dirty. So the seats, we're gonna be cleaning those and I'll show you guys what I use between getting my car detailed to clean those. We're gonna vacuum everything out. I am going to clean um, this area. It's just like, I'll show you guys what I do there. It's just nasty. This seat, I'm gonna clean that. Brooklyn's car seat has just gross. And then, oh my gosh, look at all that. So I need to take these pieces out to wash them because they're just nasty. So we have that. And then there's just some stains down there. I just have to vacuum out everything. There's food everywhere. This is actually the bucket that we store treats in, but we are, there's nothing in there. We have wipes for like hands in her mouth, her mouth. Um, over here, we'll clean out this because that is nasty. And then we have her um, bucket of toys, which isn't bad. On this side, so you guys can get a better idea. So just like I said, I need to clean the floor. Um, in the back, it's not so bad. The third row, <sighs> not so bad. There's just, oh, I need to vacuum. Look, there's some food stored up for the winter. <laughs> so, and then this is probably yucky too. That's kind of yucky. So yeah, I am going to clean up this car. And then I will show you guys the after. And we are in our garage. So as you guys can see, I'm gonna start off by taking off um, Brooklyn's cover to her car seat. It is such a pain to get this cover off. Like, that's why between washing it, deep washing it, if she gets little stains, I like to go in there with um, like a carpet cleaner try to get them off but it really needed it this time. Um, the car seat that's in my husband's car for her is so much easier to take off the cover but this one is a great car seat that covers just a little bit of a pain.
we're gonna use this Rule Light Pet Spray. And if you guys are new to my channel, my dog passed um, almost a year ago. But we used to have this, use this all the time in the house. But now I use it for my seats, my car, and in between washes for Brooklyn's car seat. And it works great for getting off, like, just whatever. This one, for some reason, the spray nozzle was like out of control. So it was spraying everywhere, but it did the trick and it got um, the seats clean. I would say do a test before you attack your seats um, with cleaning with this. My seats actually, even though they're fabric, they do not get that dirty. And I prefer fabric seats over leather. Um, our One of our last cars had leather seats and I would just like I live in Cali it gets really hot here and I never use the sun protector and the leather would like stick to my thighs and my shorts and then like it'd be so hot that it would burn them when I would sit in the car because I never use the little protector but yeah I like fabric seats and these gray ones don't get that dirty but occasionally they need a little cleaning And then over here, I'm giving everything just a quick wipe down. And like I told you guys before, I'm so sorry. I had like a fuzzy blanket on me and it shed all over my shirt. So it looks pretty gross. But um, I was not going to change it to clean out this nasty car. So sorry, guys. this back pocket most of my sun stuff is thrown in here and um, I'm just giving it a good um, just cleaning out the trash in there and giving it a good wipe down just putting those in my trunk is much bigger when the um, 
third row is weighed down, but I still fit groceries and everything in there when the third row is up, so I usually like to keep it up. And now I'm just giving everything a little spray down with Lysol, and we are about done. And we are all done, folks. There is my car. Seats are clean. This part's pretty clean. I'll show you in here. We have like all of my little stuff. So sanitizer, body spray, lotion, another lotion, deodorant, if I forget, a little prayer book, and then um, just like a little teddy, my rosary, and chapstick. And then that side is clean. And then let's go in the back. The only thing I didn't put back on because it needs to air dry is Brooklyn's um, seat cover. But all that is picked up and cleaned. And we'll go around the other side. The back looking good. Just the bags, nothing else. Third row picked up. in here it's picked up just her bucket of toys and like I said I just need to put on the um, cover back on her car seat but I always let mine air dry I don't know if you guys do that but that is it and the car is picked up and it looks good so it's ready for the next time for me to get it me and the kids to get it all dirty over all over again and the next time I'll probably be getting a detail then. But this is what I like to do in between. And as you could tell, that part in the middle, I hadn't cleaned that part in forever. But if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. <laughs> and I will see everybody in my next one. Bye.